Hello everyone, Mark here, Mark's Max Muscle, and this is your official fan 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 requested Friday winning video, and I could not be any more excited. Tom Platz versus Mike Menzer, are you kidding me? Finally, you guys voted the way I would vote. An old timey classic matchup, of course, Tom Platz and Mike Menzer, very popular for 1970s slash 80s bodybuilders tom platz 1981 we will be using for the most part when we can obviously 1980 for mike menzer i don't think this picture here is from uh, 1980 but doesn't really matter just a beginning just a front relaxed position mike took fifth at the 1980 olympia i think fifth place is a great big f u from the ifbb tom platz took third tom platz uh, took third Without further ado, guys, let's go through these shots. And it is a bit of an apples versus oranges matchup. You can see Tom Platt's biggest, best legs in the uh, bodybuilding history. Nobody ever even came close to this guy back in 1981. Unbelievable size, qualities, baby please. Papa. Little bit skimpy on the arms, on the upper body, the clavicle width, things of that nature. And when you look at Mike Menzer, wow, look at those arms, look at the little tiny midsection, unbelievable V-taper. So rated of the shoot, guys, it's going to be a difficult one to call. And obviously, these are old pitchers. We're just doing this for fun. There's no real way to say for sure. But we can speculate. We've seen enough. We, us, I, and company. We've seen enough bodybuilders and bodybuilding close-up shots of these guys to know how they would really fare against each other, and I'd probably go with Mike, to be honest. Front lat spread, another write-off as far as pitcher quality is concerned for uh, Mike Menzer. Front double wasn't, er, yeah, front double wasn't that good either. Front lat spread, you can guesstimate, you can estimate that Menzer would have a better structure in this. We know he has a better structure. Midsection, uh, clavicle width. Tom Platts, like I said, maybe not the smallest midsection. Maybe not the most narrow. And maybe not the widest clavicle either. But having said that, look at the legs on the guy. Unbelievable, unbelievable. So it seems to be a situation where the structure of Mike Menzer probably would get him an edge in the first couple of shots. Good clean shot for... Uh, Tom Platzer, you can see the conditioning. Go to the side. Turn to the side. And before I continue on with this one, I would ask you guys, please, if you do not mind, take a second and hit thumbs up on this video. We're trying for 500 likes. Get 500 likes on it, guys. I forgot to mention at the start. Get 500 likes, please, and we'll do all of the other requests. But Tom Platz is out muscling the muscle man, Mike Menzer. Outstructuring? No. You can see Menzer, he holds his far leg straight. He bows his chest out. He, you know, he maximizes that good uh, structure. And the condition of the guy. These guys are uh, flat foot, straight leg. They're about the same height. But Tom Platts, he's never straight legged. He's doing squats in his sleep, for goodness sakes. But yeah, I don't know, guys. I don't know. Tom, he's kind of winning. He's Like I said, he's out muscling the... The muscle man. Here is, for lack of a better pose, side tricep for Mike Menzer. Hey, we're going to use it. Arnold Schwarzenegger, he used this one. He would not hit the other pose. Now, Tom, he is hitting it to spec. So does that get him any more points in this? Maybe, maybe. Both guys, you can see when you do get a clean shot of Mike Menzer, you can see the guy was positioned. Con conditioned. Condition. Yeah, sorry. I apologize. <laughs> yeah, he's good and peeled. Good and peeled. So, pretty close. Pretty close. Here's the back shots. And this is kind of where these dudes separate off. Tom Platz, he is next level stuff. As far as traps, lats, calves. Wow. Good condition for Mike. And here you can see. That tiny little Victorian waistline. I don't know if his back was as meaty and as strong as his front. Now, to be fair, to be fair for you 
Menzerites, because yes, there is a church of Mike Menzer. He is, this is an older picture of his. He developed his back even better than this afterwards. Couldn't get a good uh, rear lat spread, or if any, I couldn't get any. Here's the rear double. And I got to use that phrase again, or I have to, I don't got to. I have to use this phrase again. Out muscle. Tom Platts is out muscling the, uh, the Menzer. Now Tom's right arm, his tricep, I noticed this from the front double. Just didn't want to say anything, didn't want to be mean. But it looks like it's half the size of his left. Look at that great big left tricep, matching that of Mike Menzer's. But look at the right arm. Menzer's tricep sweeps fantastic. He has a good V-taper, like I said. It swoops in nice, overall shape. But Platts has that meat. So much meat in that back. HIT, high-intensity training. You can't get more high-intensity than Tom Platts, I'm here to tell you right now. Here's the absent eye. Yeah, if you've ever seen Tom Platts doing mere leg extensions, he can turn leg extensions into a, a torture. A medieval torture, I'm here to tell you. Menzer, again, he's sleek. It's tilted a little bit thousely. He is very sleek, maybe just as conditioned as Tom. Tom's got a whole lot more muscle, and he's ripped where he needs to be. And that's it, guys. That is the most muscular. This is how we're going to end this one, by saying that you're never going to know. Unless you have a time machine, guys. Unless you were there, and if you were there in 1981, you're probably a little old by now, so you can't really trust your mind. Your mind will go on you. Your mind will go on you. I was barely here. I was I was there in 1981. I was zero. Zero. I was zero in 1981. But anyway, guys, Tom Platts, he's got loads of muscle in the bottom half. Mike Menzer, he has a better balance... I would suggest more, more more aesthetic. I don't want to say much more aesthetically pleasing. He's more aesthetically pleasing. Both guys, I think, are equal condition. I would say. I would say. Judging by some of the closer up shots that you can get. Tom Platts might have had an edge. So who wins this matchup? Ooh, it is a tough one. It is a tough one. I could very well do this a year from now. And I would say Tom Platts. Or Mike Menzer. Mike Menzer or Tom Platts. Today on Fan Requested. Fan, fan, fan. Requested Friday. We're going to go with Tom Platts. I think that he was winning in those back shots. I think that he was winning in both. And I think he's winning in the uh, abs and thigh as well. From the side. He's kind of siding towards Tom as well. I think Mike was winning the two front shots. Maybe the most muscular. But hey, hey. It's going to be a 50-50, I think, with you guys, the audience. You people. Love you people. You guys are the best. Hit thumbs up. Subscribe. 500. We'll do the rest. Have a nice one.